Over the last century, we have seen numerous players achieve greatness in the beautiful game of football. Fans fill stadiums on weekends to catch their heroes in action, but nothing compares to the emotions of seeing them swap their club jerseys for their national team colors. While the best of the best have lifted the 18 carat gold trophy aloft as teammates carried them on their shoulders, there are those who put in memorable performances that simply became footnotes in the World Cup history books. Welcome to Football Latitude's 26 of the greatest World Cup players of all time. 26. Roger Miller Miller appeared in 10 World Cup games for Cameroon and scored a total of 5 goals. He was a pioneer of African football and one of the first major international stars from the continent. Representing the indomitable Lions in 3 World Cups, Miller played in the 94 tournament at the age of 42, managing to score a goal and in the process becoming the oldest player in history to score at a World Cup. Perhaps his most famous World Cup moment was when he dispossessed flamboyant Colombian keeper René Higuita, 35 yards from goal to find the back of the net in the 1990 edition. Miller guided Cameroon to the quarterfinals of Italian 90, which is still the best run by an African team. 25. Gary Lineker Lineker is one of the most famous strikers in England's football history and the nation's all-time scorer in the World Cup with 10 goals in 12 appearances. Currently a football broadcaster and match analyst with the BBC, Lineker won the Golden Boot at the 1986 World Cup with 6 goals. He was the only English player in the tournament's history to win the award until the 2018 World Cup when Harry Kane scooped the prize in Russia. At the 1990 edition, Lineker helped the three Lions to the semis, scoring a total of four goals as England lost in a heartbreaking penalty shootout against eventual champions West Germany. 24. Gabriel Batistuta Batistuta scored 10 goals in 12 appearances for Argentina at the World Cup. Despite the disappointing end to Argentina's 94 tournament following Maradona's doping suspension, Batistuta scored four goals in four games before La Abiceleste bowed out against Romania in the round of 16, including a hat-trick against Greece. In the 98 World Cup, he recorded another hat-trick, becoming the first and only player to net hat-tricks at two separate World Cups. 23. Oliver Kahn Called up for both the 1994 and 98 World Cups as a backup, Khan had to wait until 2002 for his chance in the limelight. He took full advantage, leading Germany to the final while only conceding three goals, two of which came in the final against the eventual winners, Brazil. Even though Germany left empty-handed, Khan kept five clean sheets overall and won the Golden Ball Award, which made him the first goalkeeper in the history of the World Cup to do so. 22. Gianluigi Buffon Gigi was called up to the Italy squad for the 1998 World Cup but unfortunately failed to appear in a single game. From 2002, however, the Juventus legend made 12 appearances at the World Cup and conceded just 8 goals. Helping Liazzurri to World Cup victory in 2006, Buffon conceded a mere 2 goals while keeping 5 clean sheets in that tournament. He also recorded a 453-minute scoreless streak in the process. 21. Thierry Henry Arsenal's all-time leading scorer also had a successful career with the French national team, appearing 17 times at the World Cup and scoring 6 goals. With little buzz surrounding his name then, Henri earned a call-up for Le Bleu ahead of the 98 tournament and finished as France's top scorer with 3 goals as they won the cup, beating Brazil 3-0 in the final. He also featured for France in 2002, 2006, and 2010 and was France's all-time leading goalscorer with 51 goals until he was surpassed by Olivier Giroud, who achieved this feat at the 2022 World Cup in Qatar. 20. Jürgen Klinsmann Klinsmann was one of the best German strikers of all time and appeared in 17 matches at the World Cup, scoring a total of 11 goals. Helping West Germany to the Cup in 1990 with three goals, Klinsmann netted five times in 1994, but the Germans had aged since the glory and failed to recreate their magic. At the 1998 World Cup, he scored three times at his final ever tournament. 19. Paolo Maldini 
Italy's most capped player somehow missed out on the big prize and the same can be said for his father Cesare Maldini who played in the 1962 World Cup and was named in the team of the tournament. Playing in four World Cups from 1990 to 2002, Paolo Maldini who captained Italy a record 74 times was unlucky not to lift the prestigious trophy. His first three tournaments ended in penalty shootout defeats and the fourth to the ever devastating Golden Ball. 18 Mario Kempes The Argentinian sharpshooter was the leading scorer at the 1978 World Cup with six goals, including a brace in the final against the Netherlands to win the trophy. Kempes also represented Argentina in 1974 and 1982 and was a feared striker during his time with La Abiceleste. 17 Eusebio The Mozambique-born striker only played in one World Cup, but it was quite a memorable. Eusebio scored nine goals in 1966, including four against North Korea, as Portugal famously came back from 3-0 down to win. His acceleration and powerful strikes made him difficult to play against, as he scored again when Portugal lost 2-1 to England in the semi-final. His total of nine goals won him the Golden Boot in the 66 tournament, together with the worldwide adoration of football fans. 16 Lothar Matthäus Maradona claimed the German midfield sweeper was the best rival he ever had probably based on their clash in the 1986 World Cup final when Matthäus marked the Argentine out of the game Matthäus played in five straight World Cups from 1982 to 1998 a record for an outfield player and captained his team to glory in 1990 when he was the driving force with dynamic box to box runs 15 Jazinho After the legendary Garrincha retired from football following the 1966 edition Jazinho stepped into his right wing berth for the 1970 World Cup although positions didn't mean much in that free flowing side he was a formidable part of one of the greatest teams in World Cup history combining speed strength and skill the winger famously scored in every single game of the 1970 tournament a record yet to be matched as Brazil romped to a famous victory. Jazinho's performances in that tournament earned him the nickname Furasao da Copa, which in English translates to the World Cup Hurricane. 14. Cafu. One of the best and paciest right backs of all time. Cafu is a two-time World Cup champion with Brazil from the 1994 and 2002 competitions and is the nation's most capped player at 143 including 21 appearances at the World Cup. He is also one of only two players to ever appear in three consecutive World Cup finals alongside German great Lothar Matthäus. Cafu's speed and leadership qualities were integral parts of four tournament squads for the Samba Boys.